our Mardi Gras fanatic, Dana DiPiazza, joins us in the studio this morning with a closer look at how St. Louis puts its spin on carnival season celebrations. Hi, Dana. Hi, Dana, and that's exactly right. Parades certainly double as art shows with lots of beautiful pieces passing by us, but have you ever wondered what exactly goes into making that magic come to life? Well, I got the chance to take our viewers behind the scenes of the Banana Bike Brigade's Magic Attic to see just how it all comes together. Putting beautiful, large pieces of art on a bike and parading through St. Louis seems like a concept that could only come true when pigs fly. But this year, the Banana Bike Brigade has put its own spin on the Roaring Twenties theme with Lindbergh crossing the Atlantic. So if it didn't have wings before, it certainly does now. This is uh, uh, my giraffe. Inside Mardi Gras Inc's Magic Attic is where you can find the creative brain behind it all. Chris Kohler has brought his very own flair to the Banana Bike Brigade for over 20 years. I have fun. I just adore. I, the, I have the best job in the world. I get to come here every day and make art. And, uh, and in this studio, I can't think of anything more fun. Bringing his hard work to life each Mardi Gras is a magical feeling for Chris. And of course, if you've ever seen his crew making their way through Sular during carnival season, it's a sight you likely won't forget. You see us come down the street. Everybody all decorated, everybody wearing little outfits. It was just going to be hilarious. And uh, that's the important thing, that we have a lot of fun. I don't care if we win. I, that makes no difference to me. It's that if we have the most fun, then we're winners. From dinosaurs to lions, ducks, and just about everything in between, there's a character that you are bound to fall in love with. We're just there for you to appreciate. We're bringing a little art show to you. And... Uh, uh, the best bikes are ones that bring up happy memories, things like that, or people, I love giraffes, or I, I love tigers, that's my favorite animal. And then when you meet that person, they're just, they just have so much uh, joy in their heart when they see that you brought this to them. Each masterpiece takes weeks to complete, and it's all made from paper mache, plenty of glue, and a few other miscellaneous materials, but most importantly, lots of love. I love the snail. If you look up behind me, you'll see the snail. Uh, just, they all have their charm. And then each one was created in a fellowship with someone. So when I look at it, I just don't see a snail. I see Cindy, who that's her bike, or, you know, I remember all the good times when we made them. Just as Charles Lindbergh made the city of St. Louis proud with his successful flight over the Atlantic in the 20s, the Banana Bike Brigade is hoping to bring a similar sense of pride when they make their way through Soulard on these beautiful pieces of art. Art that Chris says makes the crowd feel something. And it's that very feeling that Chris says makes all of this hard work worthwhile. Artists and creatives are welcome to reach out to the Banana Bike Brigade if creating Mardi Gras magic is on your list of things that you'd like to tackle. You can find them over on Facebook and next carnival season we'll be creating one of those masterpieces together. So if there's a specific character you'd love to see, you should definitely let us know. Oh my gosh, Dana, thank you so much for sharing.